Hello and welcome to our first episode of Cerebral Snacks. My name is Neil. My name is Adi. Today we're going to be talking about our lungs, why we need them, and how they work. Why do we need our lungs? Well, we use our lungs for our one main purpose, breathing. Why do we need to breathe? Well, when we breathe in, we suck in air from outside, and we use mainly one component of that air in our body, oxygen. We put that into our blood with our lungs, and that goes to our body to be used to make energy. And then we give out carbon dioxide after we finish making the energy, which we then breathe out. But how exactly do our lungs work? Well, there are three main components to our lungs. The thoracic cavity is your body. It's an airtight area where your lungs sit. The diaphragm is a thin muscle that stretches across your body and seals off the thoracic cavity. It divides the thoracic and abdominal cavities. You keep your stomach and your intestines in your abdominal cavity, and your lungs and heart in your thoracic cavity. The diaphragm also serves one other purpose, we'll get to that in a second. And then, your lungs. Those are those sacs that fill with air and they put oxygen into your blood. Okay, now back to the diaphragm. So, what's so important about it? Well, when we breathe, we don't have any muscles in our lungs, so how exactly do we suck air in? Well, what happens is we suck in down our diaphragm. Our diaphragm gets pulled down by some muscles, and that creates a slight low pressure zone inside of your lungs. This sucks in air from the outside to try to fill in that low pressure. And then, to breathe out, we do the exact opposite. Our diaphragm comes back in, and that creates a slight high pressure in our thoracic cavity and lungs, which we then use to push out the air. So to make it simpler, we made a model here of our lungs. We used an old vitamin bottle, two balloons, and a piece of a straw. The balloon on the inside is our lung, and this would be our diaphragm. The straw on top is our trachea, or the pipe that leads to our nose. This model only has one lung, so this person only has one, but the model will work just as fine with two, if you want to build it with two. When you pull on your diaphragm, it creates a slight low pressure, which sucks in air, and it inflates the balloon inside, your lung. When you push the diaphragm back in, it creates a high pressure, which pushes out the air from your lung. Yep, so once again, you're creating a slight vacuum when you suck your diaphragm down, and that inflates your lungs. That's how you breathe in. And you breathe out, we push back in the diaphragm, and that creates a slight high pressure, which pushes all the air out of the lungs. Quite simple. Our lungs are so simple, yet so amazing. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Our goal here is to have fun making simple videos for some everyday questions. So if you have any other questions you'd like us to answer in the future, leave them in the comments below. Make sure to like and subscribe, help our channel grow. Thank you so much. See you later. Sorry, I'm breathing. Keep it to me.